So I've just tested the water on this turtle tank and it's quite a familiar scenario for turtle tanks. So there's some things here that need to be improved urgently. And the first thing that needs to be improved urgently is the surface agitation. So at the moment, this tank has very high surface tension because the water is very stagnant. So what we need to do is shorten this outlet pipe and put an elbow on it. So then the surface of the water becomes agitated. And if the surface becomes agitated, then the water will ripple and then the surface tension will decrease and then the gases will exchange and then that will increase the oxygen level of the water and that will mean that your good bacteria will have a chance to work. In the situation that is currently present, the surface agitation doesn't exist, so therefore your oxygen level is very low and if your dissolved oxygen level is low, that means your redox potential will be very low. That means that the bacteria will work super slow. Then if the bacteria work super slow, that means you need more bacteria to break down the same amount of waste. So this tank has nitride in it, which means that the bacteria is not effectively able to work. The other thing too is that the um, lack of oxygen means that you're going to have an increase of CO2, and the increase of CO2 is what's going to drive down your pH. And these animals hate being in acidic water. They really want to be in slightly alkaline water. So by increasing the surface agitation, we're going to speed up the rate of the bacteria to work, and we're also going to help stabilize the pH. So what we're going to do with this aquarium, do a nice water change, make sure the filter is cleaned in water from the fish tank, not water from the tap. We're going to make sure that it's got good surface agitation on the outlet of the filter. We're going to make sure that we're going to dose some water aged daily just to help detoxify the nitrite for now and make sure that goes into all new water that goes into the tank. We're going to add a little bit of carbonate hardness generator because that's going to help the shell of the turtle and add some calcium and so forth. And we're going to add some general hardness and that's just going to increase the salt and add some calcium, magnesium and other stuff that'll be good for the turtle. So if you have a situation like this, it's a really good idea to grab your phone, make a little video of the animal and what he's doing in the whole setup and bring a sample of water down to Majestic Aquariums and we can check it all out for you. So these animals, this guy's got a bung eye at the moment, but they're super tough. So you can think that everything's okay and for a long period of time, they can be okay. But your idea is to have a beautiful thriving pet, not a slowly dying animal. So don't assume things are okay. Just bring a sample of water and a video and let us go through it with you. Then you'll be a nice, happy, healthy turtle instead of on death wish.